This morning on Education Nation, learning a second language. According to a government study, thousands of public schools have stopped teaching foreign languages in the last decade. So we're going to get more on this story now from Adelaide. That's right. Well, languages like French, German, and Russian are on the decline, but two languages are making their way into a class, into the classroom in a very big way. Let's all say good morning. Okay, 早安，早安。Mandarin is on the rise among foreign language programs in schools, according to a recent Department of Education survey. Neither one of us knew any Mandarin, so we figured it was a great opportunity for her to really learn it now, and she absorbs everything. Ni hao. That's how I say hi in Chinese. Turn on the TV, and with kids shows like Ni hao Kai Lan. And Dora the Explorer. Children are already being exposed to foreign languages at a young age. Mmm, milk tea. There are even language DVDs like Little Pim teaching little ones languages. Los plátanos. Like Spanish, Mandarin, and French. Du beurre. There's a magic window for kids of zero to six years old when it's effortless for them to learn one, two, even three languages. And that's why it's important to start early. There are sensitive periods where you're more、uh, effective at learning language, and infancy tends to be a period of time where it is easier to absorb. In fact, studies show learning a foreign language can help students in other areas. Academically, children who have learned a second language tend to be better readers and writers, and they also score higher in IQ tests. <laughs> It opens up your mind, and if she can learn it now when it's easy, then good for her. Why wait? And while Mandarin is on the rise, Spanish is taught almost universally. 88 percent of elementary schools and 93 percent of middle and high schools with language programs offer Spanish. Right now, Spanish and Mandarin are very popular, and I think it has a lot to do with the way things are going in the world. There's certainly a need for us to encourage. Our children to learn more than one language. Oh no! And some parents are starting their kids early. Manzanas. I think it opens many doors for them in all areas of life. More than anything, I think it really fosters open-mindedness, and that's kind of what we're all after in the end. At that age, your brain is like a sponge; you just absorb it all. So the earlier, the better. It seems very cool.、Wow. Yeah. All right. Thanks a lot, Natalie. Sure thing.